During the Torah service, individuals are called to the Torah for the honor of an aliyah. The gabai, or honor giver, will approach you and ask you if you'd like an aliyah. Provide your Hebrew name, your name, and the name of your father or of both your parents. In my case, Aharon Tzvi ben Yaakov ben Echama. One wears a talit, or prayer shawl, when coming up to the Torah. If you're not already wearing one, make sure you put one on as you approach the Torah. When one is called to the Torah for an aliyah, one comes forward to the table from which the Torah is being read and stands to the right of the Torah reader. One begins the process of an aliyah after being called up by opening up the Torah, at which point the Torah reader will indicate to you the place where the reading begins. Take your fringes, the corner of your talit, and touch the place in the exact location or to the right margin of the place where the reader has pointed to you. Lift it to your lips and kiss it. You're now ready for the blessings. Some people have the custom to leave the Torah open for the blessings, in which case you'll want to look to the left or right or keep your eyes closed to indicate that the blessings are not actually found inside the Torah. Otherwise, one can close the Torah and then direct your eyes in any way that you wish. The blessing can be read, and I'll sing it in the traditional sing-song melody. Make sure you bow your knees slightly right before the Baruchu. Baruchu et Adonai hamavorach. After the congregation replies, Baruch Adonai hamavorach le'olam va'ed, you repeat. Baruch Adonai hamavorach le'olam va'ed, and continue. Baruch Ata Adonai, Eloheinu Melech HaOlam, Asher Bachar Banu Mikol HaAmim, Benatan Lanu Et Torato, Baruch Ata Adonai, Notein HaTorah. The congregation and the Torah reader will answer Amen, and the Torah reader will begin the reading. You should follow along inside, word by word, as the Torah reader points it out with the pointer. Some people have the custom to mouth or to recite in a slight undertone the words along with the reader. When the reading is concluded, the reader will point to you the place where he or she has concluded the reading. Again, take your fringes and touch that place right where it is or at the right margin. And again, kiss your tzitzit. Now close the Torah and recite the concluding blessing. Baruch Ata Adonai, Eloheinu Melech HaOlam, Asher Natan Lanu Torat Emet, Vechaye Olam Nata Betocheinu, Baruch Ata Adonai, Notein HaTorah. This is the conclusion of the Aliyah in Ashkenazic tradition. In the Sephardic custom, a few additional words of liturgy are added at the beginning and ending of the Aliyah. At the conclusion of your Aliyah, Step around to the right side of the table as the next person is called. Remain at the table for the duration of their aliyah, and when the person after that is called, you may step down and return to your seat.